Hello folks, Danny Panzella of DoesPockYourCancer.com. I'm starting the first leg of my travel tour to investigate Does Pock Your Cancer? Today I'm heading to Denver, Colorado, which recently fully legalized marijuana, even for recreational use. I'm going to be speaking to Dr. Bob Melamede of Cannabis Science and hopefully getting an interview with Dr. Shackelford as well. These are two of the leading minds on medical marijuana in the United States. I'm also going to be speaking to some patients who are using cannabis, as well as cannabis farmers who are developing medical strains of marijuana specifically geared towards children. Over the years, cannabis has been bred to be high in THC. That's the chemical that makes you high. But breaking medical science is showing that cannabidiol, or CBD, another chemical found in cannabis, is showing amazing results in treating and possibly curing many illnesses. So growers are now breeding strains of marijuana that are low in THC but high in CBD, geared towards children and other patients who prefer not to get high but still want to benefit from medical cannabis. You can follow the film's blog where I'll be posting previews of the interviews and locations as I shoot them. Uh, just visit the news tab at doespockyourcancer.com. You can also purchase t-shirts that help spread the message about medical cannabis and pre-order the DVD of the film, which supports us financially and will help make this project a reality. I do want to take a moment to thank all the donors so far that have made this trip possible. Special thanks to platinum level donors, Dr. Jack D'Angelo of New York City and Mark Harding of Grow Australia. Thank you guys so much for your generous support. Platinum sponsors are listed as an associate producer on the film and will also get free DVDs and a special exclusive producer t-shirt. So that's pretty cool. At the gold level, I want to thank Stephen Vasquez, Tina and Randy Downer, Tom Horn, Tom Adams, and Dave Palmieri. These guys are going to receive an autographed DVD, an official Does Pot Cure Cancer t-shirt, and they'll also be listed in the credits as donors. Donating at the silver level are Jennifer McKinnon, Mark Axon, Irene DeGange, Andy Horn, Melissa Gibbons, and John Allen. And I want to give a special thanks to my aunt Judy Wheeler, who always supports all my projects. They're going to receive a free digital download when the film is released in 2014, as well as an official Does Pot Cure Cancer t-shirt. And at the bronze level, Tina Violet, Julie Kalabi, Ben Doolin, and Brad Solomon, who will all be listed on the website as donors. Thank you guys so much for your support. This film could not be done without you. Please take a look at the donation incentives I'm offering on my GoFundMe fundraising campaign. You can check that out at GoFundMe.com slash Does Pot Cure Cancer. We're giving away digital downloads, DVDs, t-shirts, and access to exclusive interviews that only donors will get to see before the film is released. Please consider making a donation to support this film's production. Visit the fundraising tab at doespotcurecancer.com. Don't forget to follow us on Twitter, at Cannabis Juice, Facebook.com slash doespotcurecancer, and Tumblr.com doespotcurecancer. Okay, guys, I have to catch my flight now. Stay tuned and check back here often for video updates. Danny Panzella, signing out.